Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. This will be a quick one. This is a prayer request put out to me. I hope she doesn't mind me sharing it, but the more people praying, the better, right? This is from Morella. She says, now she lives down in Ecuador. I, she's the one I asked for help for rent and groceries. Okay, she says, laugh out loud this morning. She has such a great attitude, y'all. I felt the earth shaking. Not a lot. I think, however, a big one is coming soon. Excuse me. They've been having a lot of little ones. Quakes and tremors where, where she's at in Ecuador. Paul Begley was saying on January 13th, there will be a powerful wave of solar energy, which means strong earthquakes soon. I don't know how that causes that, but whatever. I don't think he just puts out just anything to scare people. Uh, although I don't follow him anymore. He's, um, uh, I don't believe he would put that out if, the, if it wasn't true. Uh, I just don't understand it myself. The science behind it, you know. She says, pray for us. Our roof is some wooden posts with metal sheets on top. Wooden posts with metal sheets on top. That's very crude. And I am afraid in case of a strong earthquake, one of those wood beams would just crush our heads. Well, unless we are raptured first. If we die, I want us all to, I want us to all die. I do not want to ever see my sons dead. Also, Salvador's house, now that's the man that she had her two young babies with until she completely committed to the Lord and got away from him. And she, he has her two babies because she just couldn't handle four in a two-room house. Okay, so he has the babies. They're two and four, I think, now. And she said, his house is better, but the earthquake might hit when he is walking with the babies and the windows or buildings around may fall. Yeah, with an earthquake, you never know where you're going to be. And, you know, even in a strong house, things can fall over on a baby. So, um, she's asking for prayers for that, and she said, I have no problem with dying, but I only pray if my children die, I too, at the same time, love. Okay, so everybody, please keep Morella in your prayers. If earthquakes start hitting down there on the 13th from the solar energy thing, however that happens, Maybe, maybe we w would be taken up before, but I think it would be a great earthquake at the sixth seal is the one that uh, will take, after, after that a lot of people will go up. That'll be the great multitude, too large to number. All right, so anyway, I'll end it here, and um, thank you all in advance for your prayers for Morella and her four children, and Salvador, who has the babies. I call them babies because they're two and four. They're so little. They're precious. She sends me pictures, and they're so cute. And she said the two older boys are are behaving better, and she's told me that. Like when she needs to nap, they're quiet or something, you know, or they'll play more quietly or help her out. And that's good to hear. All right. Bye for now, everybody. I'll talk to you later.